Hey everybody, here's a great first look at ZBrush 4 R5. There are a lot of cool new features in this program, and I'm going to start off with the best one, I believe. Uh, if you hover, this is a brand new scene, lightbox, whatever that is, brand new, brand new scene, right? Okay, if you hover over here, see through, see through window transparency, right now it's at zero. You can click on this and drag it left and right and whatever you have whatever application you have behind you it will see through because this uh, ZBrush window will slowly turn invisible right see you can see that head right behind me is uh, a Photoshop document I've created this silly little head you know and I'm trying this is a masterpiece right 20 years 20,000 years from now this is gonna be a work of art and I'm trying to sculpt it right now I I don't I've got a bad memory, so I'm not sure what that was, or what that looked like. But luckily, you can turn on see-through see-through mode, right? You can turn it just a little bit. Yeah, you can. See, I don't know, or a whole bunch. That's I like that. Okay, now let's try and even this out. So right behind me. So Alt Tab. Yeah. Okay. Let's. Mm, that's good. Right. Okay. Uh. <laughs> sorry. Okay. Uh, move it right there. Okay, little bit right there. Okay, that that's good. Now BMV. Increase the brush size, and then just isn't that fascinating? I love this new feature. I'm gonna use it a whole bunch in every project I use, or need it. Yeah, sometimes yeah. It, what's really cool about this is you don't have to have a Photoshop document. You can have whatever document you want to, or the internet. The internet has a zillion images you can search and to help create whatever you're trying to work on. Let's increase the Dynamesh. Working, working, working. One really cool thing about this feature of uh, this transparent feature is sometimes you don't want to see all it's too transparent I need to see my tools if you hover over to your tools it becomes completely visible which is pretty cool and now I can see I've got some errors that I need to work on but that's for another day uh, now let's decrease the brush size and let's draw out some masks for the wonderful fac facial features 20,000 year old people are gonna love. Okay, wow, fancy. And if I had a little bit more time, I could probably do a whole lot more. Okay, I like it. Click and drag, or click to rotate. Um, and move this in or out. Uh, let's move it out. I like that. Fancy. Okay, and then. All the tools in ZBrush are the same, it's just transparent window. I love it! Isn't that fabulous? Okay, now just to see the final result, let's go back down to zero. Isn't that fabulous? I love this new feature. I think everybody should use it.